Natalie, they're just too cute. These kids are just, just dolls. My. We're so thankful for what the Lord's done in your life. And would you just share with us a little bit of uh, what brought you to the Home of Hope? Sure. Um, what initially brought me to the Home of Hope when I was going to school at ASU, um, I was raped and I really just got really angry at God and, um, you know, started partying and um, ended up finding myself a couple years later addicted to heroin, um, you know, started IV using, contracted hepatitis C, ended up getting arrested and in jail found out I was pregnant with my daughter and um, just knew that something needed to change. And um, I came to the program and nothing's been the same since. Um, my second month in the program, God healed me from hep C. <laughs> and just showed himself to me in a way that was completely undeniable. And um, gave me back my kids and my family and um, and a hope in the future. <laughs> She's not going to let go. <laughs> well, we're so thankful that the home could be there for you and for your children and, and just how wonderful the Lord you know, takes care of us. Isn't that cool? Yeah, and, and maybe to, to the other ladies that are there, uh, you know, uh, here and the, they're going through the program right now, what would you say to them? Don't give up. <laughs> That's a good word. Let's give her a hand and these precious children. We have a